All right, this one's going to be on Ralphie Banks. It's a script to launch other Ralphie scripts. If that makes any sense. This one's sent in to me by, I forgot the name right now, but uh, it's in the script somewhere. I'll talk about it later on. Um, but, uh, you know, real easy. If you want to launch it, I have it already set up on a hotkey. And these are all the other scripts that I uh, talked about on my other videos. But now you can just launch it from here. So if I want to search uh, or I want to launch an application, I use the apps here. Hit enter and now you can launch your apps here. So if I want to launch, uh, let's say Thunar, right, I can launch it. Um, what else is there? If I want to use bookmarks, do I want to use bookmarks? No, I got a lot of shady stuff in there. I don't want to do bookmarks right now. Let's do uh, web searches in here. So if I hit enter on web searches, uh, again, most of these I already talked about in my old videos. So if you know what they are, then you know what it does. But let's say if I want to search, um, let's say Arch Wiki or something, right? Uh, I can hit tab on that. And let's say I want to search for uh, Tmux. How about that? Hit enter, and it busts out your was at your um, web browser right and then you have tmux so on and so forth so let's do your web searches again let's say we do uh, wikipedia how about that and we'll do vim if they have that in there vim there's a bunch of vims in here so if i want to do uh, vim text editor i can go in there so on and so forth you get the idea um well, the other one, what do we got in here? Let's say I want to locate something in my home folder. Let's close out of this first. So if I want to locate something, I do locate, all right, hit enter. And what we're looking for, let's say I'm looking for, um, I think I have some Xbox stuff in here, soft mod. Um, what the hell is that? There you go. I got some uh, files for my soft mod. And if I want to open them, I can go enter and it should open my zip file here and it has some exe programs in there right if i want to open um let's say a video let me meet the sound here so i'm gonna get copyright but uh let's say i do locate and i can do i think I have some x-man days of future past there you go All right the anime series and i can watch that in here um Obviously, the cartoon is better than the movie. If you want to watch uh, the timeline, anything else in here? Um, clipboard. I don't think I talked about that before. This is actually a new one. But if I want to look at my uh, clipboard, I can see what I, you know, copy earlier. Let's say I go copy something. What if I copy? Let's say we copy this fucking thing here, All right? And if I do uh, clipboard again. It should be, there you go here. This is the first one here where it says zero. That's our clipboard. Or you can use some other ones in here that I copied earlier. And that's how I do what clipboard. Uh, I don't think I made a video on that yet, but maybe in the future. Anyways, how you do this and how you set it up. So this is the script here. Where's the script? So this one is called Rafi Bangs. And this is just a uh, bash script. And this one, uh, we don't know who the author is, but one of my viewers was named More Channel Noise. He sent it in, and I did a little cleanup of it. Uh, but uh, basically, all the ones that I talked about in my older videos, I put it in here, right? Uh, for bookmarks, uh, you just point it to the script. Uh, same thing with the locate thing, we point it to a script. The web searches for a script. Uh, if you want to launch programs, we're just going to use the Rafi itself, and it's going to, you know, run the D run, and also show your window, so you can do window switching also. As far as the clipboard thing, uh, I didn't talk about it, but you can set up yourself if you want to go look at the source. Uh, anything else in here? Pretty much it. Um, yeah, as far as the colors um, or the themes. I didn't do it in here because it will look um, messy. So I'd actually put that into, let's say by this here, uh, the theme. So I just put it into um, the X resources in your configuration file here. So it should be in your home folder, X resources. And in here, um, you know, all you gotta do is paste in 
your themes. So the themes that I'm using is uh, this matrix style, you know, black and green or light green kind of thing. So if you want the same thing, I'll post this in the description and you just paste it into your uh, X resource configurations and make sure to reload it. How the hell do you reload this thing? I never remember any of these commands. There you go. This is how you reload it. Um, you know, after you paste it in, you have to reload it, right? And that's how you would reload it. Okay. That's all you gotta do. Post you all these commands in the description so you don't have to like look at this fucking video. Okay. But uh, that's what you gotta do. Save out of this. Um, and as far as all the scripts, I'll probably post that up in my GitHub also. So all these uh, other ones I talked about in the past, but we did that in the command line. This time I put it actually in a script now. So, um, you know, this is the whole command for this locate command. Same thing with his bookmarks. Uh, we're just gonna use surf raw again. Um, if you want to watch my playlist, you'll see all these other ones I talked about earlier. And same thing with the uh, web searches we're using surf raw again. And that's pretty much it for this script, really. Uh, now you just bind it to a, a hotkey. So let's bind it to a hotkey here that I did earlier. Right, so you point to wherever your script is located at. So mine's in my scripts and then Ralphie scripts collection here. And then this one is called Ralphie bangs dot sh. And we bind it to a control space. So now whenever I hit control space, I can see all my other scripts in here, right? And I can execute them, you know, and I can execute uh, whatever it does. Oh yeah, another thing I forgot to talk about, but, uh, what the hell is that? Uh, another thing is that if you want to add in like more scripts in the future, let's say you find something on the internet or something like that, all you gotta do is uh, you know copy these two lines and then um, I don't think you even need this line here. Maybe you don't think you need it because we're not doing any labels. But you know you just type in uh, either the commands that you want to use or uh, the path to your. Um, you know your scripts is at whatever you know and uh, you just paste that in there and then you have your scripts and you're good to go that's pretty much it and how you would uh, add more scripts to the list that you want to launch um, hopefully you understood all that otherwise I'll post you in the description what you need to do and it'll make more sense but uh, this thing is pretty useful you know you don't have to waste time uh, using multiple hotkeys for different scripts like I was doing before. I was making a, a hotkey for this, I was making a hotkey for this, I was making a hotkey for this. Now I just use control space and I have all my scripts there and I, I can like filter it out and search for the ones I want to use and it's much more convenient. Anyways, that is Rolfie Bangs. Um, everything will be in the description.